Jeff's been an inspiration to many in his ever-growing supportive gallery of family, friends, and fans. Many of us here tonight, and all of us have learned by example of Jeff Julian, that even in our darkest days, we can do something for the greater good. Those closest to Jeff consistently speak of his strength in facing ALS, and will say that not a better person could bear the burden. Jeff, like Mr. Hogan, you possess character, class, determination, and passion, not only for the game of golf, but in life. Tiger Woods is here tonight to be honored as the world's greatest golfer, but tonight, you're the world's most courageous golfer. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm honored to present the Ben Hogan Award to Jeff Julian. He wants to thank all of his family and friends and all of the writers, of course, who helped us get the word out and spread awareness of this disease. He is so good about being with me and doing things for me that uh, she wears herself out. So I have to say, him, I can do this. It's all right. Has he ever said, why me? No. Has there ever been pity for himself? No. I think for maybe five seconds, we, we both said, why, why now? We just found each other. They met just 21 months ago. They were married the day after Valentine's Day, 2001. Indeed, why now? If only they had met sooner, and if they don't consider. What happened in our first year? Was this a lifetime? Year? Oh, yeah, we lived a lifetime in one year prior to the diagnosis. We want to live the way that um, we always have since we met, which is we feel blessed and um, we're happy and we have to look at what we have, not what we could lose. Tell me about your ride today. Um, my ride was, it was honoring my husband who actually passed away um, a year ago today. I've, I've done what I came to do, which was ride today for Jeff and um, celebrate his life and, and his death, in a sense. 